Let me check out the moon. Whoa! I wonder just how many moons there are. I know how many there are in our solar system. How many? 178 known moons. 178? Wow! Then there must be billions of moons across the universe. The universe is everything that exists in space. All the planets, stars, solar systems, galaxies, moons, everything. I can't even imagine all of that. Luckily, scientists have sort of broken things down so we can try to imagine how ginormous space really is. Biggest to smallest, it goes universe, galaxy, solar system. Okay, so a galaxy is smaller than a universe. Yep. Ever heard of the Milky Way? Yeah. Well, the Milky Way is our galaxy. A galaxy is a large group of stars and planets. There are countless galaxies that form the universe. The Milky Way is just one. These stars we're looking at tonight are part of the Milky Way, right? Yeah, and there are more stars we can't even see. Billions and billions, all part of our galaxy. They really are beautiful. Beautiful balls of burning gases. That pretty little twinkle of light we see is a bunch of flaming gas? That's right. Every star is just a big ball of light-giving gas. Even the sun. The sun is a star? A sun is any star at the center of a system of planets. Our sun is at the center of our solar system. Well, solar does mean sun, right? Our solar system is the sun and the planets that orbit around it. Our solar system has eight planets, several dwarf planets like Pluto, 178 known moons, asteroids, and comets, too. Sounds like one jam-packed planetary party to me. <laughs> There's a lot out there, but it's not exactly packed together tightly. Just the distance between the Earth and the Sun is almost 92 million miles. 92 million? Yeah! Actually, the universe is so big that scientists measure its distance in light years, or the distance light travels in a year. One light year equals 5,878,786,100,000 miles. Phew, my head's spinning just thinking about something that big. Well, let's bring it back down to Earth and talk about something you're a little more familiar with, planets. What exactly makes a planet a planet, anyway? Well, a planet is basically a large body in space that does not give off light. So, no flaming balls of gas? Um, no. There are three things that make a planet. One, it must orbit a sun. Two, it must have enough mass for its own gravity to shape it into a sphere, just like the Earth. And three, it must be massive enough to clear objects from its orbit. This universe stuff is pretty unbelievable, Zoe. And here you thought you were just gonna do a little stargazing. Well, now that I know a little more about what I'm looking at, the view through this telescope's much clearer. Our sun and the planets that orbit it form a solar system. A galaxy is even bigger. A galaxy is an enormous group of stars and planets. I mean, billions. Our galaxy is called the Milky Way, and it's just one of countless galaxies that form the universe. The universe is so humongous that distances are measured in light years. The universe seems so simple, but... It's simply enormous. Zoe, 